Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you how to update to the new Embercoin wallet using the Mac operating system. When updating to the new wallet, you may encounter an issue with a corrupted wallet.dat file. So to avoid this error, we're going to follow these steps. In the old Ember wallet, the one where mining has been disabled and where your Embercoin is currently held, launch the wallet and click on help. Then click on debug window. This will open the debug window where we will then navigate to the console tab right here. In the console tab, we are going to dump our wallet keys allowing us to move them to the new wallet. To do this, we will type the command dump wallet, followed by the file path where we want the keys to be stored. I'm going to place it in a folder on my desktop. So I'm going to navigate to that folder, which I have right here. I labeled it New Ember Wallet. Click the gear at the top. Then click Copy as, file, as Path Name. Go back to the debug window and paste the path using the command V. Add a forward slash. Then define your file name which I'm going to call this one emberkeys.txt. This is going to create a text file. As you can see, the console will respond with an empty line, meaning it worked. If it didn't, it would respond with an error. Keep this file safe as anyone who has this file has access to your ember. Now, we must prepare our files for uploading the emberkeys.txt file, and we'll do so by navigating to where the ember files are located. For Mac, the Ember folder will most likely be hidden inside the application support folder. To locate it, go to the Finder or Desktop. Hold the Option key on your keyboard and click the Go menu up at the top. With the Go menu open, you'll notice that pressing and releasing the Option button will display or hide the library choice in this menu. Select Library. Then, select Application Support, located right here then the Ember folder will be visible inside. So before doing anything further, create a backup of these files in case an error occurs. I will place mine inside of a folder on my desktop. I'm going to copy and paste. Now that your files are saved elsewhere in a backup, we're going to install the new wallet. Proceed to delete your wallet.dat file. When the new wallet launches, it will create a new wallet.dat, which you will then upload your keys located in the text file we created earlier. So we are going to launch the new wallet. Upon launching the new wallet, a new wallet.dat is created. As you can see, nothing shows within the wallet because we have not uploaded our wallet keys. To do this, let's navigate back to the console in the debug window. In the console, we now want to type import wallet, followed by the same file path of the text file. There we go. Copy. Paste and we want to make sure that it's importing those keys. So I'm going to type forward slash emberkeys.txt and you will see that it responds. And as you will see, this will upload your keys and your ember will reappear in your wallet. Side note, you may find that your new wallet is having difficulty connecting to peers. This can easily be fixed by downloading the Ember 
.conf and peers.dat files found within our Athenium Discord. All you have to do is go to the Amber Wallet Issues channel, then simply replace these two files. So I'm going to download these. Download. And I'm going to download the peers.dat file. Download. Now, I'm going to exit out of this, exit out of Discord, and I'm going to close my Ember QT wallet. All right, and as you can see, I have navigated back to the Ember folder inside the library. And you may also notice that the wallet.dat file is here as well, as it is was created upon the relaunching of the wallet. Okay, so I'm going to grab the peers.dat and embers.comp files that I downloaded, and I'm going to simply copy and paste and replace both of these. And so it will update those. I'm going to exit, exit, and I'm going to navigate back to my Ember folder. And then we'll reinitialize and then it will begin working, working to grab those active connections on the Ember network. We hope this video has helped you update your Ember coin wallet. If you have any questions or need further assistance, please join us in our Athenium Discord server. Have a good day.